In this video, we will introduce you to the monoblock, which is one of the assembly types when producing dentures in three-shaped dental system. A monoblock is a type of denture restoration which is designed and produced as one piece, meaning the base and the teeth are combined. So why would you produce the denture as a monoblock? There are a few purposes for doing that. It can be used for injection molding, as a try-in denture which can be copied for final denture design, for gingiva characterization, or as a pre-design, for example, for designing surgical guides for an edentulous case, which will require adding radio-opaque markers. How would you create an order for a monoblock? When creating an order form, choose the teeth in the order details, then select the gingiva tab. The monoblock will be selected by default. After that, select the anatomy tab. The artificial teeth will be selected by default. Choose the relevant material and manufacturing process for each element, either for printing or milling, or both. Keep in mind to have the milling checkbox in the control panel enabled when you plan to mill the denture. Does the design process for the monoblock differ from the standard denture? No, the scanning and designing in the software is the same as for the standard denture shown in our previous videos. What may interest you is that you have got two options when designing teeth for the monoblock. You can work on pre-manufactured teeth libraries, or you have the possibility to adjust the shapes of the teeth libraries if necessary. To work on pre-manufactured teeth libraries, keep the Denture Teeth Freeform Design option in Control Panel unchecked. This is the option recommended when designing for injection molding. If you want to change the shape of the teeth in the libraries, then you need to check the option Denture Teeth Freeform Design in the control panel. That way you will get two additional tools, Individual Morph and Individual Setup, to change the shape for each tooth. What kind of production process can I use for the monoblock, and what is the output? To produce the monoblock, you can either choose to print it or mill it. After the designing process and generating the CAM output, you'll get one STL file as the output for printing and milling, depending on the order form. To generate the STL as two files for milling, keep the Output Full Denture in Separate Surfaces option checked in the control panel. You've been introduced to the denture assembling type monoblock. We hope this was helpful, and thank you for watching.